everybody can hear it's chaos. This is recovery. It's the last show for the year, and uh, you're at home. You're wondering what the hell is this dude doing on my TV screen? He's too old. He's too ugly. Well, my name's Andrew, and I'm from a band called the Foves, and uh, the rest of the Foves are behind me. My good friends. We've bought our rehearsal studio with us. We're going to have a fantastic day. Uh, yeah, yeah. And uh, Dylan, he's off. He's in the Bahamas somewhere, spending that huge ABC salary. And um, but you know that's cool. Dylan will be back next year. Today we've got Teenage Fan Club, direct from Glasgow in Scotland. We've got Chris Knox from New Zealand. We've got the Dirty Three, Australia's very own. We've got John Saffron, Margina Gordecki. Callan Mulvey, and right now, direct from Perth, WA, the magnificent Jeb Badiah! This is one of those films, people's excuses when they see something like Twister is always, oh, it was crap. No, nah, but the effects were really good. You don't worry about the plot. That's what you go for. You go for the effects well, anyway. This that's film takes that to a whole new level. Yeah. This is like, it's so bizarre. You're just watching it, and then suddenly you're thinking, what is this film about? And suddenly they go to hell, and there's flames, and there's fire, and it's all computer generated, and you really do go, Oh, I don't care so much anymore because that's good to look at. We were, to we were told not to play there, but it's cool. We're professionals. Joff, that was fantastic. Um, with, your, with your talent, and uh, we should do some nightclubs late, later on tonight. Like, woo! You know, and my preparedness to be the designated driver, we're going to go off. That was awesome. Uh, you'll be seeing Joff a bit later in the show. He's um, really got it together. Now, the enforcer's just tapped me on the shoulder and says he wants to help you guys write any Xmas card messages. I assume that means Christmas card messages. Uh, you know, it's, he's calling it Christmas card messages for the witless. So if um, you fancy yourself as someone a little bit slow, dim, no, you know, just if you haven't really, if you're a bit short on inspiration, the enforcer wants to help you out. He wants you to go to the feedback page at the recovery website uh, with a description of the person that you want to send the card to. He's going to do it all for you, basically. Having done that, it's out of your hands and it's totally up to the enforcer what he comes up with. I'm sure it's going to be really spot on, you know, the enforcer. Um, the site, the number, www.abc.net. Dot. Point. Doctor. Have I introduced the doctor? Doctor, get into get into shot here. This is my good friend, the doctor. He thinks he can do the job better than me. So you might as well read the rest of it there. You know, you go along the bottom. That's what they told us at the back, Coxie. They did too. Yes, yes. Uh, I think I was up to a dot somewhere. Yeah. Uh, might have been the fourth dot. Yeah. There's an AU and a slash recovery. Do it. The enforcer is awesome. Christmas card messages. Now we've got a fantastic story. I saw this yesterday. It blew my mind. It's Dylan over in the US or maybe over here, I don't know, with Faith No More. Let's go to it. Faith No More. Okay, I'm, uh, I'm the doctor on the uh, shy retiring foe. I uh, play chalk to Coxie's cheese as such. Um, we're going to throw up to a regular segment on recovery, which is with Jane Gazzo. And uh, she should be descending, apparently. Is that right? It's there. Here she comes. Hi, Jane. Thank you very much, Doctor. Thanks, the Foves. You do a good job playing yeah, and no worries. playing and, and talking and hosting at the same time. That's a very fine it's thing. A, it's a big effort for us, I know. Yeah. yeah? Probably yeah. bigger than Sunbury 97, hey? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> bad joke, sorry. Richard also catches up with something for Kate. So that's uh, 1997, also some new releases from the Mavises. They've got a brand new single. It's called Cry. Uh, and Thursday night, J Files. Being Christmas and all, it's a Jesus J files. It's all the songs you can imagine with Jesus. Doctor, can you think of one? Uh, sorry, I wasn't listening. <laughs> uh, well, I thought of a couple Jesus just on the spot. Jesus built my hot rod, Jesus was way cool, and Jesus hairdo. So that's the Jesus J files this Thursday night on the J files. If you can think of one, um, give Richard a call Thursday on the 1900 number. That is the Triple J access number. <laughs> if you are listening, then. Hello all, my name's G-Man, otherwise known as Jack, and a few other things to certain people. I'm the bass player of this uh, motley bunch here. 
and I'm going to announce some uh, regurgitator winners. <laughs> it works. Uh, the winners are on just down here. See that? I always wanted to do that. Yeah, look, I'll front the Hey Hey band, but tell Daryl I'm not wearing that chicken suit, all right? Just no go. All right, that's just my agent. Uh, things are really taking off. It's only been an hour or so, and um, I don't know if I'm even going to see at the end of the show because there's uh, Daryl's outside and Blackers, and um, I might go and talk to them because I'm a bit, bit over this, frankly, a bit too big for it. But um, my woes aside, um, look, I should reintroduce myself because I'm Andrew, I'm from the Foves, and um, we're the house band, and we're also, you might have got up late and just not know who the hell we are. Uh, well, ladies and gentlemen, let's thank Lee for coming on. Now, uh, quickly, uh, we've got a Starbucks comp.